Hello, what's up everyone? Welcome back to my channel. I'm back again with a fluffy brow tutorial. So I'm going to go in with my damp spoolie and just brush my little hairs upwards. After that, I'm going to wipe all of that over a bar of soap. Now, this is the key to a fluffy brow. This just ensures my brows stay in place, they stay upwards, and it basically works the same way as a brow gel. After that, I'm going to go in with my concealer LA Girl Print. Oh, no, no, sorry about that. LA Girl Pro Conceal in the shade Fawn. Now, normally, I would draw the brow first and then conceal, but then I find this way better because it defines my shape way better. I know what I'm doing even before I draw the brow. And you'll just see um, throughout the video, it's so much easier when you do it this way. Anyway, I'm going to go in with the angle brush and create my shape, darling. <laughs> Feel free to take your time when doing this step because, I mean, the most important thing about a brow is the shape. So take your time with the step. So afterwards, I'm gonna go in with my pomade that I purchased from Signature. It may say gel, but it's really got a consistency of a pomade. Like, it's really kind of hot. And I'm gonna go in with that middle shade, which is a kind of light brown. And I'm just gonna draw upward streaks on my little hairs. Actually, I'm not just gonna draw the streaks on my little hairs. I'm gonna draw upward streaks throughout my whole brow. That's how I create the effect. Effect? Yes, the fluffy brow effect. You'll see what I mean. Just um, continue watching and you'll just see. This is literally all I do, nothing else. My suggestion would be just to go with it, you know. You'll see what works for you, you'll see what doesn't. And like I said before, take your time. Eventually, you'll get the hang of it and... Close up, pop, I'm sorry. Now I'm going over with my same damp spoolie over these lines that I've just drawn. And now I'm just making sure that these lines are not too harsh. And at the same time, I don't want them to disappear by brushing them out with the spoolie. So I'm very careful at the same time. I want to achieve a fluffy brow, but I don't want it to be too fluffy, but I also don't want it to be too smooth. So you can always just work around that. If you want yours to be sharp and very streaky, then you cannot even like skip the step and not use the spoolie at all. Like I said, work with it. See what you like, see what you don't like, and just go with it. you look at that I don't want to lie <sighs> I was feeling myself yeah definitely <laughs> but yeah there you have it now I'm just gonna do the other brow but I'm just going to um, time-lapse it is that time-lapse yeah so yeah I'm just gonna repeat every single thing that I did on this other brow and yeah enjoy watching
there you have it a beautiful set of fluffy brows if i can say so myself thank you so much for watching this video if you did enjoy it please give it a thumbs up don't forget to comment don't forget to like and i'll see you in my next video bye